Hello, my name is Malika and it's to be John. Welcome back to Triumph Call Steel 3, the game in which I walk. It be, be like I'm I'm so slow that I don't even run, I walk. So are we going today or there's a free day before going? That's the question. I want to go now. <laughs> because because of TT uh Tita uh, thought that she was like live very near could that be but then then i was thinking and i'm like maybe she was talking about agate feel excess departure okay okay Ooh. just the part don't make don't, don't make me want to talk to everybody they're in the train yeah 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 they're going they're going okay yeah 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 Freddy! I love Freddy's style. Whew. We're going nearly very... I'm wishing it's not Agatha. I'm wishing it's another person or people. I don't know. Of the crew. I don't know. I'm like, Agatha got his time to shine. Please give me another one. If there is, will you tell me anything? Tita! Is it almost time? Yeah, the branch campus for your own armor train, it should be here soon. It, it can hold Valimar as well as multiple plants or lands. Even once it's here, we still got a load, not just the machines, but the supplies and the equipment too. And we're supposed to leave by 9, we're gonna make it. Yo, it's here! Huh? <laughs> Wait, <laughs> what time is it? We're Bonia! Branch Campus Clusy. Oh, we got the train! So pretty! It's silver! Oh, they're gonna help us. Oh, Claire! Hmm? Oh! <clears throat> so you came too. What the? For real? Hmm. I'm Claire. Students and instructors of Thor's, it's a pleasure to meet you all. I am Major Claire Revelt of the Railway Military Police. I'm here to hand off the armored train Derflinger to the branch campus. I haven't seen her here, right? She oh I have. I think I have. Or I have not. Oh Pablo got that crush. <laughs> Who won it? She looks pretty. Okay, we're all set over here now. Can you go help with the loading the supplies? Sure thing. Wait a second. Okay. Understood, <laughs> Kairi. Oh, Cap I mean Mayor Claire. It's good to see you again. <laughs> Indeed, I believe we haven't seen each other since the end of last year. I want to go congratulate you on graduating on your new job here at the branch campus. Though so you may not want to hear that from me. No, that's not the case at all. I'm glad to hear it. Thanks. I never could have dreamed you'd be the one hanging the train off to us, though. <laughs> Million and Lector beat me here, though. Jokes aside, you have the full support of the RMP, including security the site for your field's ex exercises. I'd be joining you on your trip to the site, so you have to put up with me a bit longer. Ha, <laughs> put up with, she says. Hey, what's your two talking about? Yuna, Instructor Randy. It's good to see you again too, Yuna. Ah, uh, you do know each other. Last year I worked as a temporary instructor for Crossbell Military Police Academy. We know each other from there. 
<laughs> yeah, I really enjoyed your lessons. And you really helped me out there that one time too. That one time. Nothing, don't pry into a girl's past like that. <laughs> there, there, Yuna. You seem to be doing well. That uniform really suits you. <laughs> Thanks, I still feel a bit weird wearing this though. Well, someone's running hot and cold today. A first lieutenant, Randy, it's good to see you again too. I cannot thank you enough for your help here at the branch campus. Well, I was kinda of forced into it. But don't worry, I'm gonna do all the work I'm given. Long as you keep your hands clean anyway. Yes, well, I should keep that in mind. It seems like there's more going on there than I thought. So this is where you have been, Mayor Rebuild. Good day, Michael. Nice to see you again, Toa. <laughs> wow, I can't believe it's really been half a year since I saw you during my time with the NGO. You can catch up later. It's nearly our departure time. Where are the principal and the professor? It appears she has yet to even load her soldant. Her soldant? I wonder if it's the golden one I saw during the Northern War. There's no need. A pleasure to see you both of your lady Aurelia Professor You are that RMP woman. Long time to see I see maiden. I thank you for your delivery of the armor train and for seeing us to our exercise groups. No thanks are necessary, I was simply performing my duties. More importantly, Principal, will you not be taking your soul then? As I say, there is no need. Neither I nor the professor will be common after all. Seriously? But I thought you were coming when I made all the arrangements. Hold on, this changed everything. We had factor in your strength when planning for this operation. That precisely why. If you if our little fledglings are ever going to learn to fly, they'll need to be pushed off of the nest. With me there, none of them will experience true growth. I already report this to the intelligent division. Hmm, what good will it do me to traipse about in the wilderness with all of you? The operation on record keep will be performed by my assistant. Good luck dealing with your sudden lack of power. Michael is mad. Well, you just have to leave the rest to the others and get going. Understood, this is such a hassle. Michael is mad, and we like when Michael is mad, because he's also a Michael. I'm sorry for the Michaels out there, <laughs> I'm joking. Freddy, Freddy! It's been three weeks since we've begun Freddy. here, and I'm sure there are still some of you with worries. Gary. But after the Panzer sold out training yesterday, a new door has opened for you. From ancient times, travel has been used as a way to foster growth. I hope this will be such a trip for each of you. Yes, ma'am! Power! Freddy! I want to go with Freddy. Can I enter this cargo? Oh. Herschel, Orlando, I leave our fledglings in your care. Understood. Please, leave it to us. I'm sure there's gonna be a lot of stuff going on. But I'll do what I can. As for you, Schwarzer, the lull that's gone on since the end of the Northern War is now over. As someone with great power, you must stay alert and always be aware of the flow of events in the world. Face that which you lack. Head on. Rely on those around you when you need to. Principal? Understood. <laughs> In regard to Panzer Soldat maintenance, I've already told you the basics. If you need to perform a minor fix, you can do it yourself. Show me what a representative of Zeiss Central Factory can do. I think this is his way to, like, take care. Yes, leave it to me. Hug now, okay. I, that's his way to, to say, like, take care. I know, I, I can feel it in the air.
Hmm. I suppose all it takes are the right words to make someone leap headlong into danger. Eh, General? <laughs> Twenty-four students and instructors. How many will make it back, I wonder? Don't say that. <laughs> all of them. A turbulent era lies ahead. Where it won't matter who you are or where you're from. If they're not strong enough to make it through this, they don't have much of a future waiting for them anyway. Wow. <laughs> I will translate that, that we're gonna enter into something that we don't care if you're a novel or an iron ball of a bracer of Ouroboros of 13th factory or a machine or a humanoid. I, I think... Go down, go down. I don't want to stop anywhere. <laughs> I just want to get there. She said that it's nearly there, and I'm like crazy to see. Oh wait, I'm gonna, I'm gonna move. I don't want to move through the train. I want just to arrive. Julieta. So I was like, and then I was like, oh my god, I was like that too. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Is this gonna be a free day? Like inside a train? I got a feeling it's gonna be like that, right? I mean, they won't be showing all of this for nothing. No, no, no. Leo. I like him. He, what is he watching? W watching the wall. <laughs> Briefing room. The fuel exos are scheduled to last for 3 days this time. After arriving at St. Ark tomorrow, we'll move to the fuel exos ground nearby. Once we finish setting up all the facilities, each class will begin their own exercises. I see, so train itself is going to be our base. So that's why we- Ah! Well, makes sense, seems like it's got pretty much anything we need. For more information on each class exercise task, please see the provide documents. I don't read. Huh? <laughs> Sorry, but it seems like class 7 isn't mentioned in here. Oh, you're right. We have prepared a special. <laughs> because of this, we plan to have a separate meeting once we arrive at the field accessory ground. Instructor Swizer and the three members of class 7 will be present at this meeting. The students, too. Oh, color me intrigue. <laughs> well, don't get your hopes up. This meeting is to go over tasks unique to special operations. Tasks unique to special operation. I wonder what they could be. Well, I suppose we'll get more details tomorrow morning. There are reports of possible threats in Thotherland. It was a miscalculation on the principal's part to not join us. However, we must simply handle matters with our available personnel. These are not simple training exercises. We need each and every one of you to tread this as thought if were a life combat situation. Understood. I'll gather up the member of class 7 tomorrow. Very well. This concludes the day briefing. Instructor Hesher and Randy brief your students other attacks tonight. For now, each of you rest up. That is all. Dismissed. No free day then. Task you need to class 7, I wonder. We will arrive at St. Ark tomorrow morning. I'm sure the student and volume are already bad. I'll take one more look at uh, free day on the train. <laughs> Is that so? It's not that so bad. It's like talking. Hello. Yes, everything is on a squad all over here. What about you on your end? Long range communication using Darkest 2, I remember hearing, sounds like... Okay, okay, too private, too private. This is main event, we don't do main events here. 
Wait, what is this? Ah, shower room. Okay. Let's shower. Sure. Oh, this is nice. Okay. Ah, no event here. <laughs> right. Ah, <laughs> uh, wait. I think there are main events, but it won't advance the story. Clear. Oh, Rin, are you patrolling the train? Yeah, something like that. I thought I'd talk to the students now since I have the chance. <laughs> Is that so? You have grown into a fine man. I'm sure Sarah will be proud. You want to kiss me? I got Alicia. I got nothing on Instructor Sarah. Sometimes my students will even scold me. <laughs> Still, I'm relieved. I was concerned about how you were faring last year after the Northern War. Well, I haven't been doing much since then. My Claire of the Railway Military Police, thank you for all your assistance back then. Oh, no, not at all. It was you, Altina, and Sarah who did all the heavy lifting, so to speak. We were able to respond so swiftly thanks to Valimar and the bracer skill guiding the citizens to safety. But it ended up in being a painful experience for both you and Sarah. I'm sorry I shouldn't be talking about this. As you know, it was the RMP who built the supplies line for General Le Guin's army of Panzer soldiers. It was all of Imperial governments, no, it was all to make His Excellency's wishes come true. There's something I've been wondering for a while now. Why does someone like you continue to work under him? How did you come to be an Iron Blood? Well, she gonna tell me. I know a little about million circumstances. I'm sure my elector and the governor or general both have the reason to. But you, Claire, you seem like you are the odd one out to me. When you're doing RMP work, you're sincere and caring. I understand why Juna's open up to you like the like she was. When I think of all that, it seems even strange. Why, Claire? I I'm. Not as great a person as you think I am. In this huge war, I'm just one small person, I have nothing. If Excellency hadn't taken me in, I would have disappeared entirely. What? Chancellor Regent Osborne is my savior. He took me in 10 years ago after I had lost everything in an accident. It was also thanks to him that I found Thor's military academy and the World War military police, places where I belong. My gratitude to him is not something I could ever hope to repay, even if I were to work my whole life. I'm sorry I didn't know any of that. Don't worry about it, I don't think any of this will excuse my actions. Rather, I believe I must face the things I've done for the future. I took part in claiming Crossbell and North Ambia for His Excellency. I must face those whose lives I disrupt in doing so. Claire. But you don't need to feel the way to Rin. You have been pil piloting your Divine Knight on behalf of the Imperial Government for the past year. But I'm sure you've been thinking about the whole you should act as a member of Class 7 this whole time. <laughs> well, it's not quite as impressive as you make it sound. But it's kind of embarrassing that you can see right through me like that. I guess I should know I couldn't keep anything from the Icy Maiden. <laughs> that title is starting to feel a little embarrassing. I am the second half of my 20s now, after all. No, you haven't changed a bit. Stockard Sarah may have changed a bit since she went back to being a bracer. But you're the same as you were when I first met you two years ago, or rather. Rivel, are you there? Oh, Michael, rain in the moment. There's something I need to confirm with you. Mayor, Michael, have I interrupted some Michael? Be jealous. Oh no, we were just having a small talk. Well then, Claire, I'll excuse myself now. Please be sure to get plenty of rest tonight, rain. I got a theory about rain. I don't think you need to force yourself to figure out your relationship with him right now. I'm sure you will eventually be able to come to terms with it, with it at all. 
So for now I think you should just take your time and slowly organize you through one by one. Thanks, that makes me feel a bit better. Hmm, I don't know what that was about, but you certainly acting compassionate today. Are you trying to replace Emil with him? Who is Emil? Forget it, I was out of my line bringing him up. No, that's not my intention. So what is you need to confirm with me? This is all the information we'll be sending east. Can I hear them? Hi! I'm glad to... No, 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 I want to hear what you guys are gonna talk. You're still here, you need to be up early. No, no, I want to... I got a theory about the accident. But I won't say anything, of course. I don't know anything, of course. But if it's what I'm thinking, and if it's revealed later on, don't tell me, guys. And if it was what I'm thinking here, I'd be like, I knew it! Yeah, and if not, I'm gonna be just on the floor. In both cases, I think I'm gonna be on the floor. <laughs> I'm a florist guy. Wait, let me talk to the people before you, Yuna. Leo. Well, well, if it ain't Structure Swazer. Seems like you're pretty close with the Chancellor, best piece of arm candy. Hey, that's strongly disrespectful to Claire. Whatever, man, she's the icy maiden. She's not about to get her feeling all hard about something like that. I swear. By the way, Schrazer, got any plans to ride that night doll of yours around? It's been great to see it in action sometimes. I don't call Valimar unless I absolutely need it. It's not some sideshow. I won't call him in just to satisfy your curiosity. If you keep acting like this, it's all just fun and games, you're going to end up getting hurt during field exercises. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Leo. Our exercises are really going to ramp up starting tomorrow, and I'm in charge of supply teams, so, so no pressure, right? But aren't you from the business family, Stark? Besides, your grades are too top tire, I think you're perfect for, for the position. I'm the one who should be worried, I was made head of the medical team. But in medical training, your first aid skills were faster and more precise than anyone else. Personally, I don't think I belong on the comms team. I can barely talk without stuttering. And on top of that, I'm supposed to be helping with the accounting operation, the Darth Lynch. But didn't you help your father with managing his territory? And that aside, you're really good with numbers. Oh, so that means we're all in the right position after all. I guess the faculty here knows us pretty well. Yeah, Instructor Toa sure is impressive. Let's hook everybody. No? Okay. Let me go deeper on the cargo and then I go back. Oh, there are like three people. Hey, girls. So we are just gonna, gonna be going out to the Condor side to do training, huh? I bet it'll be nice to just go all out and not worry about civilians nervy. But like Instructor Randy said, we need to stay on our guard. I still get the feeling some of us are treating this like a field trip. I'm sure everyone will shape hands once the exercise began. But no matter what happens, I need only light on my skills, school training. I'm glad to hear you are so fired up. What do they sell here? What is this? That's poop. <laughs> I hear that the railroad stretch all the way out to North Umbria now. Well, the ride's pretty smooth at least. Where, where is Freddy? Uh, no. <laughs> this is a pretty sweet setup. Just look at the shower. Who knows? Maybe things will even get steaming here. For the love of ages, <laughs> please don't cause any trouble. <laughs> ah, yeah, he was the one. Ah, yeah, yeah. Talking to the girls. I'm thinking too oh, much shower. This ah, yeah. is nice. I'm thinking something will happen, but nothing will happen. There is no shower event here. Okay, I get it. I'm sorry. <laughs> I want to make. Ah, Freddy! 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 St. Ark, I bet their highway are chock full of monsters with some nice meat of their bones. I'll have to be sure to sharp up my spear and knives. 
he's planning on going hunting. What what else? I can't wait, I have to be uh oh, oh, Freddy. Freddy, let me see your face. Freddy, 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 <laughs> Freddy, your face Fre oh, never mind. Tita Altina came in looking really down. I wonder if something happened. Altina. I don't know anything on that yet, but I'll talk to her. That, thanks for keeping an eye out for her. Oh no, you don't have to thank me for that. Okay, thank you. Oh wait, you, you got a shop. You got a, a, yes. real, a real shop, right? I got a lot, I got a lot. What What is that? Okay. Thanks. That's stupid. Thanks for what I didn't buy. <laughs> Altina. Altina, what are you doing here? Nothing. I was just thinking that the Panzer Soldan training didn't go well. Are you talking about your piloting? May it have something to do with how you control claims of lies? Look, some people are good with Panzer Soldan and some are. Don't let it bother you too much. But Jun and Kor got it right away. I feel powerless in a way. Hey Altina. Yes? Uh, never mind. Once we get back to the campus, you can train to your heart's content. I'll do my best to help you too. I see. Thank you. What are you, our plans for tomorrow? Oh, class 7 will be soon early in the morning. Well, I'll tell you the details then. Just get a good night rest. And of course, you can always talk to your classmates. Understood. I should return to my room now. Good day. She seems frustrated, and that's an emotion. Just like when Milim first came to the school, she started to change. Oh, we gotta make her human. More cargo? Oh my god, how many cargoes we got? Oh, Randy. Well, we'll be using the Dragon and Hector for our field exercise this time around. Don't worry about the second Dragon, that's one just for backup. Anyway, once we are there, I need the two of you to board. The first mission of the camp is to move the Panzer Soldat off the train. This should be easy, why I'm so nervous? Seems like Wayne is the type of to overthink things, like Machias. I hope he doesn't let it mess him up. Ah oh, yeah, he's the one like Machias. <laughs> it's an honor to be able to get my hand on a Panzer Soldat so early in the field exercises. Valimar! Are you done with your duties for today, Rin? Yeah, all done for now. Sorry for keeping you cramped up here all the time. <laughs> As I say, don't worry about it. I got an accustomed to it during my travels with you. <laughs> Hearing that makes me feel a little better. Well, I'll arrive tomorrow morning so it won't be too much longer. Understood. Hmm. What's wrong? I felt a princess, a movement in the mana currents. In the direction we're headed, far to the south. A presence, can you pinpoint it? No, it's vanished. Was it simple a function in the septum veins? Perhaps I was mistaken. You're never mistaken, Valley. I should keep an eye out for any further movement. Yeah. Either way, let's be on our guard moving forward. With any luck, I won't have any need to call you. Agreed, but if you must, please do so without hesitation. I will protect you and your colleagues, just as I always done. Thank you, I'm counting on you, my friend. Valimar is able. Ah, they are smart. It will be perfect life if nothing were to happen, but should need, should need a rise, please call me. For now though, rest and prepare for tomorrow. Okay, nah, 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 we're going back. Okay, sure. That's night, Tita. Maybe I got back and see more orbit or something. Okay, I'm gonna call, talk to Juliet. Uh, what? The RP mayor with that pretty face of her and that luscious figure she's playing dirty. Try not to be too decent against Mayor Claire, okay? <laughs> Why? Whatever makes you think you, I will. So, Instructor Rin, do you like older woman? Age it doesn't really ma- Wait, what are you trying to make me say? Oh, I'm so glad to hear that. You know, Mr. Karin, it's just only us in here right now. Just you and me. Could you please stop teasing me? I'm your instructor. Oh my, didn't see you, me? Why never?
Oh, Muse. Wait a second. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Altina. It's Dr. Rin. I noticed you seem happier with Captain, I mean, Claire is around. Think I act normal. You worked with Mayor Claire before, right, Altina? Yes, but only for a few missions. She has invited me to spend time of duty with her and Million. That was nice of her to offer. Why not go hang out with her next time, she asks. You may be able to learn something new about each other. I'm not interested. Okay, I'm sorry. No, where is Kurt? So, we'll be in the solar line by tomorrow morning, huh? You seem happy, Kurt. Have you been on the solar line before? Oh, instructor, yes, I have, though it was a while ago. I lived in Parm until I was about 10 years old. Oh, that's the little town the southern edge of the province, right? If I remember right, it's famous for its cloth and dyes. That's right, when I lived there, they had a number of old-fashioned workshops and all over town. A Bander School training hall, too. Really? I didn't know your family had a training hall out there. Well, maybe we can stop by while we are in the area. More important, what we'll be doing our field exercise? I'll fill all of you on details tomorrow morning. I can say that we'll definitely have some downtime we can use to go visit Parm. Think you can give us a tour of the place? Sure, I suppose I can. I just hope I'm actually able to get something out of this trip. Don't worry, I'm sure you will. Oh my god, Kurt. I'm looking forward to seeing my old friends and acquaintance in Parm. I can't believe it's already 7 years. I wonder everyone changed it quite a bit by now. I've never been there, so I, I, I cannot be excited. Oh my gosh. Oh, Mr. Corillion, please don't hesitate to ask if you like something to drink. Sure, thanks. And thank you for all the hard work, too. It seems like a little small talk, but how is the kitchen? Oh, it's great. It's true that the space is limited, but because of that, everything's stored very efficiently. I'm so happy that I get to put this place to good use. <laughs> Glad to hear it. Is you not the one that's gonna make me advance the story? Let me save. Or do I need to go to my room so that I, go I think I'm gonna need to go to my room after I talk to everybody and then it's gonna advance. Why? Because I think I need to sleep, right? Oh, is the briefing over? What's the plan for tomorrow? The other classes got instructions, but not us. About that, I actually wasn't told either. I'll be able to give you the details tomorrow morning. Huh? Ah, uh, come on, you're, you're our teacher. You need to get it together. This is just like what happened during the interest ceremony. Well, it seems like our exercises are going to be a bit of a special case. All of class 7, including myself, will get a brief tomorrow morning. Fine. Instructor Claire was way more on top of things at the police academy. <laughs> I got no chance if you're comparing me to my or Claire. I'm a little surprised though. You respect her so much even though she's Erebonian. Like I told you, Kurt, it's not la that I hate Erebonian or anything. She's the perfect commander, an incredible skilled marksman. She's caring and sincere. Since the ones who saved me and gave me a chance chance. I'm just saying it's impossible not to respect her, unlike a certain someone I could name. <laughs> well, I agree you can avoid respecting her. She's helped me out more times than I can count since I met her back when I was a student. Oh well, that explains why you two seem so oddly close. No, I'm, I'm close to... A, so it's because you guys haven't seen Alicia yet. Oh my god. I may have to thoroughly interrogate you. It's not like that. I'm nowhere near as good as Mayor Claire, but I promise to do my best I possible can. I don't know what we'll be doing tomorrow, but make sure you get enough rest tonight. I don't need you to tell me what that. Car game. Oh, car game. Okay. Wh what we got here? I, I, I think... Let me see if there's a red mark somewhere. That means my room, maybe. 
What is this? Oh, okay. Oh, there's another cargo. Who is here? Oh, Toa. Oh, Pablo. Can't believe I'm able to watch someone operate a train right up close like this. Um, I'm so glad they believe me. Wow, Dad. Thanks for giving me birth, Amy. <laughs> Someone's happy. Science, this is the first big trip this train's been put through. It was decided that we handled operation at this time, but I can feel ice boring through the back of my head. I see, so this is one of those train fanboys I've seen hearing about lately. Respect, Pablo. Pablo, we love you. I love your accent. I see, this is where they scramble the communication signals. The state of the art interface is really nice. She seems well versed in these things. Okay, maybe Toa was the one that gonna advance the story. So we are gonna save in case it advanced so I can stop the gameplay. <laughs> because too much. Too much. You look busy as ever, Toa. Ah, well, yeah, a little. I have a feeling class 9 is going to be in charge of setting up camp for the fuel exercise tomorrow, so I thought it would be a good idea to start preparing now. Ah well, sorry for sandaling you with even more work than usual. Ah no, it's fine, I'm used to being busy after all. You used to be my slave, besides I'm sure you guys are going to be even busier than me. You are my slave now too, right? You may need to jump into battle at any time and you haven't even been told the details of what you're supposed to do. Well, that's something I'm used to. But now that you mention it, I still rather know what we're supposed to be doing. Well, the main mayor even was talking it seemed like a pretty dangerous situation. Unlike some other regions, there's been very little info about Jaguar's Corp movements there. Oh, really? The border with Liber... At the south, after all, since Jagger Corps are completely prohibited over there, it's not easy to them to get into everybody from that direction. <laughs> I see, so it's been difficult for them to operate in large squads. But if they're in small elite units, that could be trouble. Yeah, we shouldn't take things lightly. We need to lead our students and get through the day in one piece. Yeah, I don't plan on losing to anyone, and you are not my owner. Good luck tomorrow, Toba. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two, two. Get a good night's sleep and try not to overdo it tomorrow, okay? <laughs> can do. I think now we can. We need to go to our room, which I don't know which is our room. Testing, testing. One, two, three. This is a message from Darflinger Car One for all Branch Campus students. We will arrive at the destination for our field exercises at 5.10 a.m. tomorrow morning. Please be sure to get lots of rest so you're ready to wake up bright and early. Can not scream? I think I've done enough for today. I should probably get to bed soon. If there's else I need to do, I'll head back to my car. All right. Now nah, we got it. Okay, got it. Okay, guys. We're gonna let it here for today, of course. What I was going to talk about, we're gonna be near liver. I'm so excited. Nobody say anything. Uh, nobody say if I'm gonna see somebody. Nobody say nothing. Nothing. I want to be on the floor if something happened. We're gonna be near of liver. Freaking near of liver. Liver. You know, liver. Liver, the, the liver. Okay. So, guys, thank you so much for watching. And see you in the next one. If you guys want. I don't know. Myself in this city